water fish. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hi guys, I'm here to share what we're up to. You may not know, but we are on Patreon. Now, Patreon is a wonderful platform for creators such as ourselves. It's a place to do two things, really. Uh, the first is for you to say thank you for what we produce and share on social media and YouTube, but it's also a place where we can take a video such as the one that we're about to share and do a bit more of a deep dive. Um, it's a platform where we can share in our producer's notes why we do things. You can enter our mind and our thinking in that exact moment and we could share why we approached a certain fish a certain way, why we used a, a, a certain fly pattern or a leader length, that kind of thing, or maybe even a dropper nymph and why we made that cast. It's a perfect place for us to take a video like the one we're about to share, turn it into a master class, share all the information and have you ask any follow-up questions at Patreon so that we can have a bit more of a conversation and you can get the maximum that you can out of our videos. Uh, we hope to see you over at Patreon. Uh, we'd love to sh have you join our group. So come on over at patreon.com slash jensenflyfishing. The second day had a feel. Waking to clear, calm skies and no wind in Patagonia is special. We've seen this exact day so many times and each one is magic. You don't forget them. Where yesterday was a day of working to get fish of interest on camera, today... Well, today was simply a day where Marcelo could spot brown trout and we'd catch it. See it, film it, catch it, magic. We stuck to our guns all day. We didn't make a cast unless we found a fish that was able to be filmed and cast to. If it wasn't a neat video fish, we moved along. The river was exactly what we knew about brown trout. This was the day we'd been waiting for the entire trip. While we loved being on a different water every single day of the trip for 10 weeks, this was our day to dig in and do what we do. We were simply looking to dissect a brown trout river. We did exactly that. guys so we've got a brown trout um, that we spotted here from up on a high cliff bank right across from me up in there and Dave's actually up there filming right now and I've just come over with Marcelo and we're getting into position seeing if we can see the fish first ourselves and then we'll get into position and uh, give him a try here and it's the first one of the day a um, little different day than the other day a little cooler morning um, and He's risen, I guess, a couple times we've seen, and Dave can definitely spot him from up on the bank, so I'm gonna see what I can see from my vantage, and then we'll go from there.
Okay guys, here, so I'm gonna get into position. Um, we figured out the spot that we think we need to be and hopefully it won't spook this fish getting into that position. Should be okay, because I know I'm well behind it. I think I see its tail. Just gonna get up. A, can I step a foot forward? Yeah. Yeah, I see its tail. Rose petal is on its head now. Okay. Not doing much, but we'll see. So this fish isn't too far away from me, guys. I'd say it's, you know, again, maybe two and a half, three rod lengths. And I've got to try to cast up to its left. And I've got to make sure I don't hook this overhanging stick here, Dave. These bunch of sticks off the bank. I'm going, Dave. Yes, got him. Nice, nice, nice. Come on, fish. Come on. I'm going, Dave. Yes, got him. Nice, nice, nice. Come on, fish. Come on. Thank you. Come on, fish. Come on. We'll see. He's already owned me in those weeds. No. Nope. Oh, come on, come on. Come on. Come on, fish. Come on out. Yeah, I might already be screwed. Yeah, it's probably a non-starter getting this fish, guys, because he just tore into a big weed bed over there. And I can't feel, like all I feel is a ton of pressure from the weeds, the current. I still feel him. He's, I know he's wedged. When you know a fish is rather wedged, it's kind of a good, good luck chuck. Yeah, um, yeah, I still feel him. Come on, come on, buddy. Come on, come on, come on. Come on out, come on out. Yeah, I felt the head shake. Come on, come on, come on out. Come on, come on out. Yes, yes, yes. Come on out, I might have a chance, might have a chance. Yeah, come on out, come on out. Okay, okay, okay. We have a chance here. I don't want him too close in these weeds. No, 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 no. Up, 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 up. No, okay, 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 okay. I try, hang on, let's try to bring him in here. Okay, here we go, here we go. Dig, 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 yes! Woo, Marcelo, thank you. Yeah, man, oh. Patience, patience for me. Patience, oh, guys, he slowly good, wanted huh? to come out. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, what a fish, what an awesome brownie. Love that eat. <laughs> bring him out here, just bring the head out. Beautiful, beautiful, head up for me. Yeah, gorgeous. <laughs> I'm super stoked about that fish, guys. Um, what a beautiful place to get into position, only a couple rod lengths downstream. And then Dave and I had talked and, hey, I wanted to put my fly to his left, make him come to the fly because it was on this beautiful light marl and, and yeah, it worked out great. Um, biggest thing though on that fight is the patience thing. Um, I got a little antsy after waiting for what felt like a little bit of time where my rod was downstream of that weed and I had kept the pressure and I could still feel the fish, but it wasn't budging, nothing was happening. And I thought, well, maybe if I try to get upstream of it, I knew, you know, you heard me saying it's probably not gonna get landed. Well, no, I needed to give it just that much more patience because eventually what happened, I kept pressure. I kept lots of pressure on the rod and the whole line and everything. And I eventually could feel that fish move. And as he moved, he was kind of loosening the weeds around him. And I just kept keeping pressure, keeping pressure. And, and as he moved, I kept adding a little more pressure backwards, straight out from whence he came into the weeds. Because if you, if you try to do the angles, um, against the weeds, it often doesn't work. Um, sometimes you have to change position, but in this case, those weeds are, they're, they're a big stretch of weeds that are just like this that you're looking at, but further out there. 
and now that fish was wedged in there and I just had to keep that pressure and slowly more pressure more pressure as he's as he's wiggling then releasing letting me give more pressure and eventually he came out okay guys so I got a same pair of fish that Amelia had to go at a skinny post spawn kind of hurting rainbow on the shore and a chunkier shorter brown trout it looks like a female brown trout out in the seam um, neither one of them's doing a thing so this is this is fun <laughs> but I'm gonna go at it with uh, 15 foot liter 3x I think no it's 4x to a, a double-legged um, I call it all blacks it's just a black foam pattern with lots of legs and crystal chenille underneath it nothing special I'm gonna try that it might not work it might work we'll see but the problem up the shoreline here is that the rainbow is on, oh there it comes out yeah, it's it's charging out um, you wouldn't see this on this camera but Amelia get the uh, GH5 going the rainbow is facing us along the bank facing us and the brown is just in the seam a rod length out and facing the other direction so two fish doing two totally different things and now i don't see the the brown of course why why would i expect anything less but oh no there it's right by that rose petal there so it's it looks like it's about three feet down it might spook too though with the with the angle of the sun i might end up flashing it but might pooch both of them by getting spooking this guy into that one again which is never good but that's a high probability see that this one dropped quite a ways oh he's right here behind this weed bed up to the right see he's dropping mills so he's he's right here now anyway get me into position here that was off is really yeah, I see that. I'm I'm not going while the wind's up either. I see it way up top. It cycled down already once, so I'm just gonna actually gonna wait back here. Okay, now we wait. This is the game. Okay, I'm gonna go slightly to the left, hopefully. And that was slightly to the left. Yeah. Yeah, waiting for the fold, right? No, no you don't. You may as well do that. <laughs> that was amazing. Come on. Here's the pull. Right into the net, right into the net, right into the net. Just like that. Woo! <laughs> Good job. Hey. Awesome. What a fish, eh? Nice Gorgeous fish. Nice and heavy, fat. Ready? Okay, here we go. Wicked. Gorgeous fish. Say when you're blue. Five, four, three, two. Okay, ready? Okay. I'll go down and up again, and here we go, though. Yeah. Awesome, gorgeous fish. Whew. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <Poof -a. laughs> so we were just standing here, guys, and I was about to prospect, and I looked out, and there is a fish that's holding just in an exposed pocket um, between the weeds so I am going to give it a go here with my smaller beetle pattern and see if I can get him to come take so <coughs> here we go oh he didn't want to budge maybe it's not sure looks so good oh okay so he wanted to budge to his right <laughs> He exploded on that, guys. Absolutely exploded on that fly. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, come on, fish. Will I get him out of these weeds? We're gonna find out. Come on, come on. How would you come, how would you come, how would you come? Oh, there we go. Free, 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 free. Yeah, man, right on. Nice brownie. Woohoo! <laughs> 
Come on, back it up, back it up like they do in New Zealand. Back it up. Come on. Yeah, we'll swing them around here. Yeah, yeah, that should work. Perfect. Yeah, oh, I need the net. Just, he's not huge, but that's, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right on. <laughs> oh, yeah. he's a jumper, all right. Isn't that cool? All about where you wanted the fly to be. That's neat. And in the net. Yeah, man. Sweet, man. Awesome. Love it. So that was neat. Both Marcelo and I here were looking for that fish because there had to be one kind of in the zone. And it was just a small pocket, like maybe, I don't know, a couple feet by a couple feet wide uh, in between the weeds. And I looked out there and at first I thought, okay, is that just a weed, right? Yeah. It kind of looked almost like just a weed itself, but oh no, no, then it moved just enough to say, no, that's a fish. And we confirmed, yeah, it's a fish. And hey, put the beetle out there and wow, that, that take was awesome, eh? Boof! Yeah. <laughs> Exploded. <laughs> Exploded, yeah. <laughs> yeah, lots of fun. All right, guys, well, now I am gonna prospect the water with a slightly bigger beetle um, and just see what comes, what else might be hanging out in these weeds. Now I wanna get a cast that's right up, a little tighter to this whole bank. See if anyone's holding tight to the bank. Just gonna play these weeds right off the end of it. No, okay. Then I'm gonna do a cast further out right off of those weeds. No, okay. Couple steps forward. And right in here. Great spot if anyone is tucked in and wants to come flying out from that bank. Oh yeah, oh yes. Oh, what a take. What a gorgeous take again. <laughs> Man, that's fun. That's fun. Come on, let's bring you down. Not a big fish, but a fun take. Really fun take. Still a good fish, just not a just not a massive one. Till he starts fighting me way downstream. <laughs> Come on. Try to surf him in. Come on. These jumps right in front of us are just perfect. Here we go. It is beautiful. Go for it. No. Oh. Try to pop it in you. There you go. Nice. Woo! Sweet man. Really beautiful fish, hey? Oh, it's plenty. Oh yeah. No, it's longer. It's longer than the last one, hey? We good? Perfect. Yeah, above the water. Nice. And slowly down. So that was really enjoyable guys <laughs> that fish came that last fish came right off the bank um, right up ahead here in tight and just looked like the perfect spot to get a cast so i won't refish that water okay now i got to get one again tight into this shoreline Oof, no not into the grasses oh let it drop off twitch twitch i think that guy came from underneath those grasses right below me but how about right in there? Yes. Come on, fish. Oh, if there was to be another fish, I think that would have been the cast. But he's not. That's cool. No. Okay. In tighter now. Yeah. 
I got to forget there was, I didn't get a shot right along this bank. Yeah. Let's just see in the shadow. Oh yes, the shadow line. Good, really good fish. Really good fish. Oh wow, that's a nice fish. Yeah, it's a big fish. It's a big fish. Come on, fish. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Marcella, we're gonna have to. I oh shit. Can you can you jump down? Yeah, I don't I don't know if we will, but let's try. Yeah, jump down, jump down. Jump down. He's almost he was almost ready. Be ready to dig. I'll try to bring him to you. No, not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. No, no, not yet. Okay, I'm surfing, surfing, surfing. Yeah! Woo! Woo, woo, woo! <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, man, it's really nice. Hell yes. Oh, what a fish. Awesome. All right, so. Let me get ready to let this guy go. Oh, it's a really nice fish, hey? Eh? Just, yeah, where he came out of was so incredible. Yeah, right tight to the bank. Had to get that beetle right along it, and man, haha, <laughs> that's what I love. What a fish, guys, yeah. <laughs> absolutely love those moments and all I was doing was prospecting um, this river is full of structure amazing trout structure and I was standing right where I am right here and up above me I'd say not even maybe 10 yards you can see there's a line of what they call calafate hanging over the river and there's kind of a, a shadow a true shadow right along that and I just popped that cast right in there as tight as I could and yeah you just see that set of lips come out suck it in yeah I knew knew it had to be probably a big headed male I've seen that enough in our fly fishing career that you go yeah man good fish so yeah lots of fun and the nice thing this time is that he didn't want to fight me all the way down because out here lots of deeper weeds he could have gotten hung up in but I cranked on that fish, had three X on, and then we brought him right into this little bay. And Marcella did an awesome job of, <laughs> of netting him. And hey, that's what we live for. Great, great moment here in Patagonia. Okie dokie. So these guys tell me that there's a fish right on the bottom right here and I have to double nymph it. So there he is. That's deep. Fast, fast, fast. Heavy enough? Will he move? Did not move. Gotta go higher. No, too far out. Not moving. Yeah, okay. Come on, fish. Okay, so I'm gonna go on the inside here, see if I can get it down deeper quicker. No, that's not gonna get there either. He just has to move, doesn't he? Okay, here we go. Try it way up there. Okay, so I'm getting a good, good gauge on the wind upstream. That's gonna be fun. Oh, oh, got him. Double naked nymph. Got him. He dropped, hey, off that shelf. Woo! I saw that head turned down and white mouth open, and here he is. Big, fat, heavy thing, hey? He's going to have to, I think we're going to have to land it down here, aren't we? Walk the dog a bit. Yeah, really heavy fish. Yeah. So I'm going to go like this if I can fold her head. If she'll let me there. Nope. No, <laughs> she doesn't want that. I'm in a wash zone now. Up, it's a heavy fish. Where are we going? You're right in here, you think? Okay. What I was looking at, I had, I basically had this to land the fish, if not in there. But I mean, if it comes along here and decides it doesn't want to go out there and it wants to go out there, now I'm in that sticks over there. So I absolutely had to crank on that fish.
Okay guys, my, uh, my lovely wife has found me a gift fish. And two days ago we fished this river and I got my ass handed to me two casts in a row in the same exact log on fish, I don't know, 26, 28, 24, 26, whatever inches long. And now my wife has found me an exciting fish. And what I mean by that is right there in the middle of the, in the river there is probably 25 to 26, 27 inches sitting right there in the glowing sun. But you know what's gonna happen? Yeah, so we know if I if I hook up, if, 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 um, it's going there. There's no way in hell it's not going under the willow. Um, so the only chance I have is to draw it as far left as I can with the big beetle. So I'm going to stick with this big beetle thing and try to draw it laterally over to the left. And actually before I even fish, I'm going to tie on 2X. And I'm going to do 2X because I want to gun the crap out of this thing if I hook up. And if I can gun it, gun it, gun it, and then as I play it, he's gonna go that way, and I'm gonna try to wrench it this way, and we're gonna come, if I hook up, the plan will be this way, it'll arc underneath this willow, and as it does, I'll fold it this way and try to bring it into the pool. 10 bucks says I don't win, but you gotta try. Why? Why? Why do I have to try? <laughs> you Because you always gotta try. Always, always try. Thing. Okay, well, I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> Hello. I'm doing my thing, you do yours. Okay, so you see it? Yeah, oh, yeah, right by those two rose petals. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Wind stopping. yeah. okay so I got the 2X. <laughs> no, it's different. I got 2X. And with 2X, this is a, a long mother of a cast. So, <laughs> that's deep and it's bushy. Will he come to the dry fly? Will he come? Okay, let's just size up the cast. Okay, that's not that bad. Could be worse, right? Yeah. Okay, now, how about we roll it? Gotta come to the left, he has to come. No, that did not go my way. Okay, so the wind kicked it back. Okay, where's my fly? Was not a good cast. I'm trying to feather it. I don't want to. Here he comes. Yeah. Okay, this is my what I talked about under that. Oh wait, 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 wait. Strip, strip down. See, this is what I'm talking about. Will he come? Will he come? Under, 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 under. Fold, and keep coming. Come on, this is my only chance, right? My only chance. Come on. Right here. Up. Where are we? Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, hey, 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 hey. No. Come on, fish. Come on. Okay, right. Shit. No. No. Okay, go down. Just a touch. Foot, two feet, two feet. Go, 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 go. Right there. Right there. Okay, hang tight. Hang tight. Come on. Come on. No. What should I do here? I know I want to fold this, but come on, get it up. Come on, up. Come on, fold this way, please. Just once. No. I, I have such little space to work with here. Okay, I'm going to go this way. Okay, I'm going to try to keep him here. Can I tr try to keep him here? If, can you do it? We might be able to fold him. Come on, Dave. Yeah, baby. Yeah, 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 yeah. Everything went to plan. <laughs> you don't get that. For, uh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Woo. Oh, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> no swimming. Yeah, no swimming today. <laughs> oh, wow. Did you see that thing come over? That was the only way was to draw that fish over. Good. <sighs> hey. Awesome, man. <laughs> You didn't have to rescue my ass today. <laughs> what do you want, love? Okay, so it's all Amelia. You tell me what you want. Perfect. Woo! That was fun. I'm so happy for you. Had to come. He had to come left. Oh, yeah. Had to come. He had to come this way to have a chance. Yep. Awesome. Here we go, love. 
<laughs> what a fish, yeah, hey? Man. What a fish. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to go okay. down. Yeah, we got to get out of the and mud up. here. And I'm going to come back up. Up, up. And up. You good? Beautiful, yeah. Man. Okay, here okay, we go, down. love. Okay, guys. So, uh, if it sounded a little bit doubtful and kind of self-deprecating, but at the same time cocky to call that kind of shot, how did I know what I had to do? And, and well, I still needed luck full stop you have to get lucky with those and I got a lot luckier than I thought I would but it, um, we've seen browns come to flies and you, you know you feed the fish well during a hatch you can feed the fish cast to its feeding lane and drift into the fish with terrestrials you don't want to do that you want to put it to you know in that case I knew where that fish was I wanted to I wanted to smack that fly on the surface with a smack and let it come three four feet over uh it's something you see in new zealand all the time with cicadas you see it with beetles in new zealand um you see it at, at home in canada with grasshoppers you see it in montana and the states with grasshoppers let the fish come to the fly and i knew before i even fished for this fish that i was gonna get the take if it wanted a dry fly it had to come to the left. I was not gonna allow myself to cast to the fish and risk it turning to the right. I wanted that fish coming left. Why? Proactive, you know, the old proper prior planning prevents piss poor performance. Get it coming left. Then when it eats left, hopefully it turns to you or, just, or goes back and you can hold it back. Those big male browns usually aren't hot rainbows. They'll fight by rolling. Um, and in this case, that guy came out here and it was like, okay, I knew, hold it along the willow, hold it along the willow. And like I said, before I even fish to it, there's going to come a point where you're holding it like this, where you have to fold it like that right now be, in order to get that pressure to keep coming and drawing and pulling it from this side of the willow. You do that, you got a chance. And then it kind of came over and it was like, really, this isn't gonna, not going to last that long if that tippet holds. That's why I went with 2X in order to crank this fish up quite often along this edge right here those peck fins will flare out like that and it'll just glue to the bottom well that thing allowed me to pull 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 with that 2x and bring him up and boom 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 and then he came up here it was like okay we have a chance to bold him right off the hop and i i still think it was a seven pound brown i don't know plus or minus well i don't think it was eight and i, I don't think it was in the sixes i think it was in the seven somewhere and those are the ones that sometimes you can stop their fat rolling behavior and flip them into the net and our friend up there uh marcello was there with the net was like yes and we got him proper prior planning for uh, piss poor performance we got everything that we hoped for and we got some lucky breaks and we got one hell of a fish in a stunning location on a great day here in chile just amazing Okay, so we cannot see. We've got shadows and we've got a really nice bank right here. Has to be a fish kicking around here. Just try to downstream it out. Anybody come out? A little tighter. Not that cast. A little out. See if it draws anybody out. No. Nope. Smack it. Anybody want to come out? Yep, there he is. I always have to work those tail out undercuts. Always a little brownie around. Amelia with the call on that one though. Take the time, she said. Take the time. Yep. Yep. Amelia says take the time. That's what we do. Yep. Hopefully, hopefully this one doesn't get ahead of steam and cut down the shoreline because I'd be pretty much in trouble at that point. Fold, little buddy. Thank you. Awesome. Sweet. They're so heavy, hey? Every one of them is a, a fat little bugger. Yeah. Yeah, so do you want to just video the release kind of thing or size this up? Try this. Did he move? That was below him, I think. 
Okay, I have to just come this way. Don't go any further over. Yeah. Now I got my ear on that cast. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna try. That's big fish though. Whoa. Try to keep them out of your fish in the middle here. Try. It's a big fat brownie is what this is. Yeah. Watch that other one though, still it's good. Yeah. See, my problem is I can't control that fish from here. I can't control this fish from here. See? Turn, 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 turn. Turn. Just try to walk the angle back. Kite this fish. And you're gonna be right here, yeah. I'm gonna try to get him upstream of you, then I'm gonna try to fold my rod this way. It's the only chance. I gotta try to keep him low. And I'm gonna, if, if I can get the angle on him here, if I can fold him this way, it's a big if at this point. As soon as I fold, I'm gonna fold right at you, okay? Three, two, one. No, I don't like that angle. No. I'm gonna fold them this way into the net. In, into the net, yeah. Nice. Woo, fuck, I thought he was a goner. <laughs> yes, awesome. Oh, that's lucky, that's lucky. Gorgeous fish. Yeah. And head up. Yeah. You ready? It's beautiful. Okay. It's a stunning fish. Here we go. Yeah. Look at that was a gorgeous fish. Yeah. Oh, lucky. Yep. Yeah. We've we've got a gorgeous uh, brown here, guys. It's surfing the back end of a weed bed, and yeah, it's just beautiful. You can just see his gold shape, just kind of swaying left, right in this spot, and. Uh, I'm not sure about landing this fish because the river right here is actually one big sort of giant causeway and we've got a lot of calafate on the banks and not not many too not too many places to go down where it's actually shallow enough but hey um hook up should be pretty sweet if i get a chance for it and uh yeah so he's just literally out oh, there's a calafate bush off the left here and he's just out from it and swaying back and forth in there. So it looks like the spot that I'm standing in right now is probably my best cast to him. I mean, I'm hopeful that getting forward like this and waving my stick isn't gonna kill my opportunity with him, but I think I have to go right from here. Okay. Yeah, I think so. He just rode. Oh, perfect, okay. That wind's gonna be a bit fun. It's gonna be a bit wily, wily here for me. So I'm gonna wait, pause for a break in it, and then go. Okay guys, so I've now actually changed up to a gray stone pattern because he didn't wanna eat the small beetle or the sedge. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go with that now. See what happens here. Okay. Okay, let's give this a go. Okay, and... Yep. Oh, he looked hard. You saw that? Yeah, he looked hard. No. Okay, I'm gonna go to, actually go a little bit to his right, but don't lead him so much. Eat it, no refusal, huge refusal, guys, last minute. Kate, drop her nymph it is. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah. Right on. Okay, here we go. Has a chance if he wants to come over. No, I gotta get right on him. Yes, and eats the dry. Oh, I think it dropped to the dropper. Good luck, good luck, good luck. Good, heavy fucking fish. Heavy, heavy, heavy fish, guys. Heavy, 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 heavy. 
I don't know, man. I don't know. He's in that weed like nobody's business. Oh no, he's off. Pop, he's off. No, he's, yeah, he's off. Jeez. Holy Good crap, boy. that was pretty amazing. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> what do you think of that, Marcelo? It's amazing. <laughs> Crazy, eh? Awesome guy. Oh, Good shit. Job, hey, thanks, man. Well, guys, like I said, you know, fighting this fish, getting it to land, non-starter. <laughs> but yeah, that, that was fun. What a fish. So after all that, guys, timing's everything. Um, you know, I put on the caddis pupa, but that fish came and took the dry fly, just smoked the, the old uh, gray stone pattern. So yeah, wow, what, what a fish, so much fun. Um, yeah, heavy weed, I mean, that fish jumped tore into that heavy weed there's actually a lot quite a lot of current here current pressure you can see that in there um, not much of a break and uh, deep deep water too so no chance <laughs> but man that was super fun loved it every moment of it the visuals again were just awesome Okay, so I've just seen, I, I'll tell you when I'm going to go, just seen him and I think my plan is to try to go upstream of him a few feet and maybe a few feet to his right, Dave, because that's where he keeps feeding. Yeah, but you're going to line him. Okay, I'll try to go left of him then. Um, that's the hope. I'm going to wait on, on that wind. I will go left, Dave, and it might be closer to five, six feet to his left. That wind is just causing, yeah, it's just causing way too much disturbance on top, guys, so that I can't see this smudge. Here goes, Davey. He's still there, yeah. Oh yeah, hammered that stonefly. Hammered the stonefly, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yeah, 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 what a fish. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> what a dance, guys. What a dance. Oh, my God. Okay, let's try to do it here if we can. He's not done yet, of course, at all. But that's awesome. That was fun. <laughs> Woo! What I'm going to try to do... I prefer to do, if he lets me, Marcelo is up in here, maybe. He's not done, he's jumping yet, but let's try in here. No, not to you, no, oh, no, no, no. Yeah, I know. Okay, Marcelo, whoa. <laughs> Just a spunky, spunky brown. Okay, I might get need you to reach out with the net a little bit when I'm ready. I'll try to bring him right to you, but. Hang it. Here we go. And walk it in. There you go. Nice. Awesome. Woo! Wow. Wicked, man. <laughs> yeah. Nice bueno, one. bueno. Great fish. Hey, hey Dave. Yep. Ready? Yeah. Up. Flies are out. Oh. Got it. Beauty. Yeah. Okay. We're on. Okay, fish is coming out. Here we go. Right to me. Okay, and three, two, one. Well, that was a hot fish. Wow. <laughs> you know, once I hooked him up, I mean, he ate that stonefly, just gorgeous eat on top. And once I hooked up, wow, that fight just had me going. I mean, talk about just a, a complete skitter right across the surface of the water below and then multiple other jumps. Oh, you know what? This is the kind of stuff that we've come here for. Um, really love this particular water piece of water that we're on like a giant spring creek very very special spot to come and yeah just that was a moment that you just love every bit of it <laughs> you can't not yeah yeah awesome so okay guys so I'm I'm here we're getting late in the in the day here 
way out in the middle here. Uh, it's kind of soupy swamp stuff right in front of me. And, well, lucky for me, I spotted myself a rising fish way across the way. So, um, maybe a cast, maybe two. If it doesn't come, we'll move on. But I think I see him way across there, kind of. I bet you when I get out there, uh, waist deep in the water, it won't be a way across there. But it's a long ways. I'm just going to get out here. I've got my Grace Polywing Stonefly on. I went with a little extra foot and a half of 4X just because I don't know where this fish is. And I'm going to be crossing the sun as I land. There he is. Okay, good. Um, yeah, that just around that, that one patch of weed. The only one I'll be able to see from out there is that big heavy one. So I kind of have to try to cast, use the wind, and kind of push across with a little reach and see what, we'll see what happens. In theory, it should go fairly well, but... Uh, if it comes this way, when I go that way, it'll be over just as quick. So let's go give it a go. Okay. It's easy spotting from here when he comes up. Oh boy, yeah. Okay. Whoop. And there's the soup. Oh yeah. Soup, soup, too. Oh yeah. Well, I'm waist deep. Right where that leaf is now. Right? You ready, love? I'll give it a go. I'm going to start short as always. You know what I mean? I think that was, what, a foot, three feet shy that way and two feet up? Yeah. Okay. Um, trying to trying to see my way in there. Okay, here we go. That should do it. <laughs> Strip like a son of a gun. Oh, start short, work your way in. And if you're too short, so be it. But if you're too long, it's over, right? That's the whole kick of it all. Uh, I'm just gonna get my line in. I don't know, yeah, I don't know. Up. It's not that big after all. Okay, I take that back. <laughs> Hot! Hello! Yeah, maybe right here. Let's see what he does. He does that. He does, he does flips, he does tricks, he does cartwheels. And if, if he holds there, this would be brilliant. Oh, don't go in there, buddy. Let's fold you this way. No. Okay, let's fold you this way. Come on. This is where that 4X might bite me in the ass. But see, if I lift, I'm going to go like this and try to fold him. No, he's not ready. He wanted to kick there again. Okay, let's keep this low. Put your net right there in, in, in theory. In theory. No, he's going to not like that. He has to fold. He almost folded there. There we go. Come on, fold this way, bud. Come on. You don't always want to fold upstream. Oh, you don't want to drag your fish upstream always. Okay, hang tight. Okay, well, let's just get that over with. Um, really? Okay, one more try. I'll do this. Yeah, maybe try to walk him. I'll try to walk him and do a, a loop here. What do you think? Will he, will he let me do a, a, a low loop? One more try. I don't want to bend this hook out. Come on. And oh, we're going to fold him. Will he fold right there? There we go. Wicked. Nice job, mister. Thank you. Ah, gracias, amigo. <laughs> Very good day again. Jeepers, hey? Amazing fish. Woo! Gorgeous. Gorgeous fish. Um, you I am now. Okay, and what a fish, hey? Okay, get up for me to try to get okay. some free. One, two, three. Okay, it's absolutely four. stunning. We okay, I'm gonna go down. You ready? Yeah. I'm Here ready. we go. What a stunning fish. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Yeah. Gorgeous fish. Well, guys, our poor guide Marcelo thought he was gonna have a coke here soon, but nope, there's another <laughs> fish. And when there's another fish, no coke for you. There, oh, Ooh. see, that's what I mean. Oh, that was it. Okay. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Ah, that's that's a long ass cast, isn't it? Well, that's if that's the same fish. You're yeah. Than that. Okay, well, okay, might have to keep coming around here. Oh, now look at that thing go. Yeah. Okay, guys. So as I was just saying, hey, um, he thought we were going to go home and get ourselves a coca-cola but no i'm gonna there's a fish over there i could launch a bomb and cast but i'm not gonna get there 
So easiest way to uh, is to get closer, move my feet. Trouble is I'm gonna be, well, through here somewhere is over waist deep. Yeah, whereabouts, where? Oh, the original one? Yeah. Okay, so there's still two fish there. Let's, uh, I gotta get out here. I stole Amelia's waterproof backpack so I could clip on the GoPro. Let's, uh, let's try this. See if moving my feet and swimming at the fish. You're gonna come out with me and swim, right, Marcelo? No, let it go. Boom, boom, boom. boom. <laughs> yeah, right about now, <laughs> with a Coke, hey? <laughs> oh, holy, yeah, there could be smarter ways of getting in the river, but that's the most, big rise? Ha <laughs> ha, you. Okay, so that's step one, and I'm just gonna ski down that slope. Okay, I'm not gonna take too long, I hope. Okay, I've gotta try, start short, right? Just keep working my way across, because we know there's a second one somewhere out there. A little further upstream. Kind of like... Fish. That one. Okay. Ah, well that pooched the second one. Okay. Come back. Come back. Here we go. Yeah, I'll try to get them over. Just back, walk them backwards. It's the Kiwi way. Okay. No, no, I don't. Just extend your net. We'll see. It's not that big. No, we'll get there. Let's just see. Don't worry too much, right? Yeah. Air in the net. Thank you, sir. Gracias, senor. <laughs> here, let me do. You just stay there, Mills. Yeah. And here. Yeah, I'm gonna. That's a gorgeous take. You were tight on that, eh? <laughs> oh, look at how fat that thing is. Yeah. Okay, let's do the release. Yeah. Wicked. End of the day, guys. Absolute stunning day. That yeah, was pretty damn stunning. So, so much, so much gratitude. Last winter, yeah, it's a Southern Cross kind of night, says Amelia. And really appreciative of Magic Waters and Eduardo for having us down here for such a long time this winter, spending a second summer and really, Super appreciative. This was a stunning day. Big smile. Stunning day. <laughs>